Hi folks, a bit of an odds and sods day today. I want to get this axle back in the real light regal chassis and just do some odd things today. So come along for the journey. Right, well as you know in the last Reliant Regal video, anyone viewing from all over the world who are not familiar with what a Reliant Regal is, it's a free wheeled car basically and we were very good at building them back in the uh, 50s and 60s over here in the UK. Well I've got one of these now, it's a Reliant Regal and it was made famous for a TV show called the uh, Only Fools and Horses and if you look in my car plan late, <laughs> playlist, playlist, you'll see I've got a whole series of videos of me refurbing uh, this free wheeled car and this is the rear axle out of it. I had a problem with it. It was leaking I'd had it put back into the chassis I now then had to take it out again and put it back in again So we've now repaired the leak as in the last video and so we're now going to try and put this back in the chassis and uh, You can come along and watch us We just I don't think we've done these up tight anyway, do we? No. Are they undone? Hand tight your ones? No, I need to suck it. Yeah. Let's just drop that down if I remember right. That's it, yep. Now I've got to take these bolts out of these shackles here as well for the uh, suspension. Just make sure that they're out. They're coming from the back if I remember rightly, yep. Right, so what we're going to try and do then is to lift the axle up onto here, onto these little pegs, isn't it? And then obviously then try and lift it up and put the bolt back through, yeah? So you, you want your big bolt ready. So if we get the axle in place then. Right, you ready? Yep. It's not heavy, is it? Just slide that over. Into the... Right, you on there? You can take the weight on your shackle then, can't you? Yeah. Just lift it up. Hopefully line it up. Should have brought that bleeding rubber mallet out here. Mm. Right, that's that back in. Right, those are also nylock nuts, so hopefully they don't come undone. Right, so now what we've got is these brackets down here, which slide over the axle, and that then provides us with our shock mounts for our shock absorbers at the bottom there as you can see which are literally just floating like that so we're just going to whack these on now So basically I'm back to where I was now with the back axle in prior to my uh, leak for the axle. I've got two pints of axle oil to put in that. I won't do that yet, I'll do that a bit nearer the time, but um, I've still got these brake pipes to put on here. And as you probably see, uh, there's a, a rubber pipe which I run from front to back, which a few of the subscribers sort of said that really that should be a, a different, a lot of more solid pipe. So I actually got a larger diameter uh, copper pipe for the fuel pump because it's a mechanical fuel pump on this one and uh, obviously having the larger size and using just a brake line type pipe could be beneficial for the engine so that's that so the rear wheels are now ready to go and i want to get this thing on the floor now as you probably know because i want to use these stands to get, take these down to jimmy's unit to when i start the upside down work i'm going to flip the bodywork upside down you'll see a little bit later on i've done some i've started on the bodywork uh, when we're going to be doing some fiberglass work in the next video, so I've done some little cleanups and all that of the um, the bodywork. The main bodywork now is is rubbed down, ready to be uh, repaired now. So you, as I say, you'll see a bit more of that a bit later on. But I've got to rebuild the front wheel up now. I've got the new brakes for this and the, the new brake shoes and all that, and new springs and all that. As you can see, the um, the kingpin in this, there's no play on that whatsoever. It's absolutely solid, but uh, and it's nice and quiet as well. And 
this was the original shop that was on there, although it's in pretty good nick. The A-frame's all perfect. I've put new rubber bushes in, if you can remember rightly, in here. And uh, you can see it's full of cobwebs where it's been sitting outside at the moment, but uh, no worries there. So really, just to build the front up there, finish the pipe work off here, connect the brakes up, bleed the brakes, and this can then go down on the floor, and that will be ready for me to mount the engine in as you can see i've got the engine mountings at the front there i've got to sort out the radiator mounting jet they need the re new threads cut on them as well as the back here as you know i'm going to be putting i've decided to put an 850 engine in it purely because i've actually got one available in the log cabin so i'm going to be putting that in i'm still going to keep the 600 engine i'm not going to sell that in case any further time in this car's history someone wants to put it back to standard for whatever reason they'll still have the 600 engine so if i do sell it in the future it'll be sold with the 600 engine but with the 800 engine fitted or the 850 engine fitted these aren't too much problems to get out but apparently i've got to change the gearbox mount at the back here so uh, i've got to sort that out yet i've not done that before and also bearing in mind that it's going to have the 850 engine in i think the 850 robin or rialto engine i'm not too sure which one it is i've got but mate, when we have a closer look at that we'll try and find out but that will be using an alternator and then as i say i'll be converting this to to a negative earth system so that we can run some uh, like normal ancillaries off of it for example anyway that's enough for out here for the minute i've ordered a set of them long torx bolts we're still going to take the barrel off of that flymo and just see the state of the piston because someone sent me a link to a video of someone where they still got one running when the piston and the the bore was actually scored up so I'm going to maybe still try and get it going. I'm not sure. We might do a bit of a bodge job on that just to get it running, to see if we can get it running. There's a lot of people out there who have done JB Weld fixes. You've probably heard of JB Weld. It's like a, a metal replacement adhesive sort of thing. And people have actually built pistons out of this stuff as well and got engines running. So we may or may not have a play about with that in the future. Keep watching anyway just to find out. So um, anyway, we just going to play about it today. What the <laughs> fucking hell is that? What is it? It's getting louder. Is it a microphone? Can you hear this noise out the back here? Hey? Scrap van. Oh, scrap van. We've got no scrap here, boy. What's he saying? It's a scrap van calling. I don't know what he's shouting out. I hope he don't stop past here and think this is a load of rubbish. Right, okay then, that's the axle back on. I'm glad that's back on now. I've got these two vents here for the uh, ventilation inside the windscreen of the Reliant Regal as well. And as you can probably see, they're in a bit of a state. They are all rusty. And as I say, while I've got these off, I might as well actually give these a sandblast and give them a repaint. So, so I'm gonna just put these through the sandblaster now. Let's see what we can do to convert these and make them look at least a lot better than what they are. Yeah. Hello, what we got here? Who's turned up? Look. Oh, look who's turned up. Mind your head on that door. Bloody hell. Oh, you tall, look at you. Oh, yeah, look, look hey. at me, yeah. It's the Hoff. Hoff? With, without the uh, Trans Am Trans man, Mr. Lee. You remember Lee? Hello, oh, my good man. man. Well, look at my man. Don't touch me. <laughs> He's got a tip. Oh, <laughs> well, I know you're on tiptoes anyway. Hello there. Anyway, what you been up to? Tell, tell them what you been up to. Oh, uh, uh, is this all right? Yeah, it's sweet. Do you want to lift that onto that? Oh yeah, but, oh, oh, with these, with these. I've had, I've had a... Hold on, talk a bit louder. I've had a bad no. day! Well, what have you been up to? <laughs> well, uh, I got stranded. Yeah, go on. Trans Am broke down in, again. In a Trans Am, because yeah. I thought this good man had fixed it. Oh, you've got your lot of radio here. I am not, yeah. Don't you? Yeah, no, I'll just come out and share. Oh yeah? I can feel it like... Well, you feel this is padded. Like glow. This is padded. Was it? It's lovely, it is. Oh, it's lovely, isn't it? Yeah. yeah your hair's clean. Eh? <laughs> You've got two big handprints on your back now. Anyway, so uh, I, I thought I'd take it to... You went to the seaside, didn't you, down to Skegness? I went to Skegness. Got, I, I, I drove down to the... Um, Seafront? Yeah. By... Uh, by, by the waterside? By the, by the pier. By the, oh yeah, by the pier, and you yeah. Go over, you go over a bridge, and, bridge. It, and then you go down, there's... The cars don't realise you can go down there. Cars don't know that? No, what about the people driving no, the cars? Probably, yeah, yeah. Anyway, it's an ice cream man. Oh, lovely. So, of course, I, I, I pulled over and yeah. I... You do a lot of talking like that, do yeah, you? Yeah, and I, I didn't stop the engine because I've having troubles again with it. Still having troubles with so, the trans uh, He thinks it's the VAT system, the vehicle anti-theft system. So I got out. Listen to this. 
So I got out and I thought myself ice cream. He said, uh, You thought yourself ice cream? He said, I didn't think Knight Rider would be down here. Oh. He said, Oh, I've got to have to take a picture. I said, I went like that. He said, No, look, you. Why haven't you told me none of this? Hey? You didn't tell me none of this. Well, I can't Are tell you, you everything. Are you making it up? No, no. Are you no, making it up? No, 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 I'm not making it up, no. So, uh, where Knight was Rider. I? Where was I? Well, you was down by the seaside. Yes, I had my ice cream. He said, do you want, do you want the... Peanuts? It should be right back to us as a kid. Did he say, do you want treat? He said, do you want treat? Tri uh, Treacle. Dri dribble. <laughs> dribble. Do you want a dribble? Strawberry, strawberry. Oh, lovely, yeah. Strawberry. Oh, yeah. Mr. Whippy yeah, ice cream. Yeah. He could all have my hands. He did, did he? <laughs> did, he, did, he did he lick it off for you, did he? Or? Nah, huh? leave, it, leave it out. Huh? Yeah. I've done that. So, uh, what do you have, a 99? A 99, for those of you in uh, a different country, is a, a cornet yeah, on ice cream. It was, a, it was a double cornet. With a whippy ice cream, not, not a scoop. It always repeats what you say. Eh? I had a, I had a flake. With a flaking, that's what they call it. I don't know what they call it a 99 for. Do you know, I don't know. No Do idea. you know why they anyway, call it a 99? Anyway, he gave me a serviette or a napkin yeah. to hold it. Yeah. Oh, like they do with little kids? Yeah. Well, I didn't realise I should have had that underneath because when I got you the last You had it on the ice bit, cream? I had a hole in the bottom and it all came all oh, down there. Oh, unbelievable. So I'm driving along with the trans air with one hand as you do with ice cream. Everyone as you do when you're driving along, yeah? One-handed, yeah? <laughs> yeah? Remember, we're moving this thing, PC constable Hey, look, I'm automatic, so you know what I mean? Well, you still got a bling hold both wheels with the I have my knees, I have my knees. I've seen that done as well, people. I know, I've seen that, yeah. yeah. Who yeah. done it? I don't know, but I've seen it. Have you? Yeah, yeah. It's bad, isn't it? Yeah. Anyway, yeah. turn back the car, yeah? So you turned yeah. off and it wouldn't start again. No, this is a different day now. Wasn't I don't want this to drag on, by the way. Oh, all right. Well, you can always edit it. Can you, you yeah, but do I, don't anyway. to, I don't want to say, oh, I had an ice cream and then I've got the car fixed. I don't want it to come across like that. Just say where you ended up and how you got it started. Right, this happened the other day. Uh, We've had this. We're going back I've just had now. it done on the MOT. Past so the MOT. One of the spark plugs uh, wasn't firing right. Yeah, that's so nothing to do with the MOT. No, 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 no. no. So he had to, it was the carbon, the carbon emissions. Work where. So anyway, we've got, so it's going nice. But you've got seven other cylinders going lovely, anyway. going lovely, it's going lovely. Anyway, I thought I'd, I'd go to uh, Skegness. So. We've had this, we no, just said no, this. No, no, sorry, Maple, Maple thought. No, this is another day. Stop <laughs> it's again, stop it. It's another day, it's another day. Don't you day. put both your hands on my shoulders, will you? No, another day. Another oh, you hot, I feel the heat right now. Do you know what it is? What? It's my personality. Fear. Fear? You fear, you're fearful of something, isn't it? It's you, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> anyway, <laughs> car's going now, that's all that matters. Uh, I don't want in no more, because you've, you've, uh, anyway, you've, you've had your 15 long, minutes of pain. <laughs> Got a long story short. You should have said short story long. Yeah, long story short. Uh, what? Yeah. Uh, I, 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 oh, hello. I, 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 I'm a teapot. Oh. I'm a teapot. I'm a teapot. Oh, hello. <laughs> oh, I can crash your brain. <laughs> oh, he what? <laughs> he's he's sworn in. Oh, yeah. No, he's sworn oh, in. Sorry. I've got to bleep that out. <laughs> anyway, I uh, half an hour. I thought that's okay because it usually starts in twenty minutes. Got in. That, that's the uh, the alarm bit, and uh, I started out. Nothing, not a dicky bird. I thought, all right, okay, all right, I'll go out to B and Q. So I went out to B and Q. <laughs> so I went out to B and Q, uh, and I walked around there for a little while. Then I come back, and I got in it. I thought it must start now. So it's getting late. It's getting later, and it wouldn't start. I thought I've got to get back. I've got to get back. And what do I do? So I'm panicking. I'm panicking. Anyway, that's why you're hot. I got out. I'm pushing it. I'm rocking it. I'm banging it. I'm putting it in this gear. I'm doing that. No, it's all about you. And, and 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 then I've done the car. I've done it to the car. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> we've lost about two thousand viewers now since you've come on. Anyway, <laughs> unbelievable. Anyway, anyway, turn around, turn around. Anyway, no, not that way. No, 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 turn that way. Anyway. A nice gentleman came along. Oh, lovely! And he said, "If Can I, I have an ice cream? If I, if I had start leads, yeah. jump leads, I'm, I'm, he said, I ain't got any." Yeah. I said, "All right." So he said, "Well, another couple come over, and they didn't have any." And they, I said, "Well, there's B and Q over there." So, and then she said, "The lady went, it's Alfred's." What, like that? Yeah. yeah. So I went to Alfred's and I said to the geezer, "I said, um, hello." No, I just picked up because I, I do want to get quick. So I picked the first ones up, ten yeah. pound. Yeah. Went to the thing. He said, well, "What engine you got, in, mate? Is it what two liter?" I said, no, it's 5.7. He said, what? Oh, this is getting edited out. I said, it's 5.7. <laughs> he said, you're having a laugh, ain't you, mate? I said, he said, well, you got a lorry? I said, no. I said, I'm outside. My car is a Trans Am. I said, I've got 5.7. Who are you talking it to? It won't start. Who are you talking to? I don't know. There, I don't, I'm here. I was He's over there. You're going to get down there. I was taught not to look at the camera. Well, I can't see who you're looking at with them bloody things on. Oh, put them back on. Oh. Anyway, where was I? You went to the, you got to the beach, you had ice cream. 
No, this is another day, another day. Anyway, so the geezer, I bought, he made me, but I bought, <laughs> I bought these jump leads. <laughs> they're like hose pipes. What? They were what? You sure? So, oh, yeah. <laughs> hey? They're like, they're thick as hose pipes. Yeah. Anyway, so we've done that. Anyway, we've put them on the, the, the battery. I'll put mine on, on, the, on the positive and negative. He's put his on these. He's told me, he's told me this. Also, I've heard it all. No, he's put his on these. As I've put my negative on, flash, smart! Flash. Bloody nearly blew me off backwards. Blew like, me off backwards. Blew me off backwards, he did. <laughs> did blew, blow off backwards? <laughs> blew me off backwards. Blew me wig off. <sighs> anyway, and he, I said, you've got them on the right way around. He said, yeah, I've got the right way. And he went, oh, sorry. I put my wrong way around. <laughs> so as he put them back on, he put them on wrong again. While he's doing, while, and then while he's, he's got flames coming out of his back. While he's talking about this, come with me and we do this. <laughs> Uh, finished article not perfect but uh, definitely a lot better and definitely easier to paint now when you compare it to to that one it's uh, so much easier with a sandblaster if you have got access to one I do say advise you to get one anyway I'm gonna leave it here for now I'm gonna make Lee a cup of coffee listen to some more of these old rubbish see you later bye for now